Hi, I'm Lou with another episode of My Car Story. Today we're at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway and at the 500 race coming up, and I'm here with Rick Parsons. Rick's a sponsor of mine here at uh, Indianapolis, so thank you for allowing me to come. You're welcome, always. Now, with that being said, Rick, uh, how did you do last week at uh, Road America? Well, we uh, it was kind of a rainy weekend, but uh, we got the feature race in, and uh, we're lucky enough to win. So that's always first good. place, first place. So the race winner, congratulations. You're so welcome. with that being said, we've got a wonderful car that came in second at the Indianapolis 500, 1988. And what car was that? This is uh, Emerson Filippaldi's uh, March, run by Patrick Grayson. Emerson and Filippaldi's car. So let's yeah. take a look at that. So let me grab the cameras I usually do. We will go straight to the nose of the 1988 March 88C. As you see, <laughs> that was only in one person's rearview mirror. Wow. Look at the ground clearance. Here's my hand. <laughs> and there is, there is that right there. So let me walk around the car. Rick, so come on with me. Let me get an overall look at the side of the car. Unfortunately, it's a wonderful day today. And uh, come on back with me a little farther. How long have you had this car? I've had this car about uh, two and a half years. And you just got it back, correct? We just got it uh, completely restored, engine completely rebuilt. Uh, it's a fresh engine car, ready to race. Ready to race, just like 1988. And uh, we uh, didn't bring the starter, but we will bring it the starter to the next event. And I just want to give you some of the details there that you can zone in on yourself. Look at the wing. With the Marlboro. And that right there. Wow. Now a lot of people saw that end of the car, by the way. And Rick, you were sharing with me that, uh, that this interior of this car, and these are the big pieces here. The, we left that exactly the way Emerson Filippoli sat in the cockpit, exactly his uh, seating arrangement, uh, his panels. Uh, so he sat right on the metal floor. Right on the metal floor, get as low to the ground as possible. Wow. It's all original from that standpoint. Unbelievable. Your water, your oil, your fuel. Kind of neat how it has the march there on the handle. I'll get the shot down in there so you can see all of those details. The Chevrolet car. Let's do this. Which is the same as the other one. That. And the mirrors are tight. And that is an awesome car. <laughs> that is good stuff. So Rick. Now tell me what, uh, tell us about Vintage Indy Racing. Come on over in the sun a little more so we can see sure. it. So t tell, me, tell me a little bit about Vintage Indy Racing. Well, there's continues to be a growth in, uh, in getting these cars out and actually racing them, whether we race them in road racing. This car is all set up to run road racing with the uh, vintage groups that uh, run racers at, uh, here at Indy on the road racing circuit, Road America, Road Atlanta. So they're all, they're all available to race in their own class in these vintage uh, road racing events. But also there's a number now of events that happen at the big oval tracks in which you can bring the car, you can run the major oval circuits in the country and uh, uh, Pocono, uh, uh, Indy, uh, and Phoenix where they have a time during the major race events where these vintage cars come out and run the run the circuit, run the ovals. So, how do people uh, find out about vintage indie racing? Well, the uh, couple ways of doing it. Uh, the uh, one way would be to to, to get a hold of me. Uh, I have pretty much uh, information on all the forms of 
vintage racing that go on with these cars. And it's at vintageindyracinggroup.com? Vintageindyracing.com. Vintageindyracing.com, got it. Or uh, reach me on my cell phone. That's What's your cell number? Area code 239-707-2775. One more time for those people who just grabbed a pen. Area code 239-707-2775. Come and get your in vintage Indy racing yeah. car and come racing with Rick. See come if you and can, have some fun. See if you can pass them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Rick, for being on my car store. Uh, you're welcome. Thank you.